So, welcome everybody to our first test stream on YouTube. Basically, uh, we want everybody to give us feedback whether or not they're seeing this link, whether or not there's jitter, there's lag, uh, because we want to keep doing this from now from now on. Uh, this is going to be on a retro game, but later we're going to try doing stuff like The Last of Us, and I'm sure Jared's going to like do a last a let's play on that. So. Uh, uh, I got nothing except for Mega Man X, and I really wanted to give this a go for quite some time, actually. Uh, and uh, this is going to be on the Wii U Virtual Console, as you can see here. Hopefully this works well. Let's see what happens, and let's do it. So, funny story on Mega Man X. Uh, this is actually, I think, one of my first Super Nintendo games, or my first Super Nintendo game. Uh, I got very strong memories with it because uh, I used to love Mega Man uh, Classic on uh, the NES. I played Mega Man 2 and Mega Man 4. And uh, those are the only two games I played basically on the NES. But uh, what happened was when I was little, I was looking for... Uh, we were at the Safeway in, in my local town of Jeddah, Saudi Arabia. And we were just browsing around and suddenly we found this... Uh, that was when? When was it? 92, 93, 94? I can't remember exactly, but in the mid, the, the early 90s. Uh, we, I discovered my, my local game store, which I deal with to this very day. It's been like, what, more than 25 years of dealing with this game store. I discovered it there. Uh, we were just browsing around Safeway, and suddenly I found this game store on the side, and it was playing Mega Man X on the Super Nintendo. Back then, I didn't realize this was the Super Nintendo, but I did... I did recognize, hey, that was Mega Man, and he was jumping, and he was doing these really cool stuff, and it looked dark and it looked gritty. Like, this is cool, what is that? So I went inside, and I discovered, hey, there's a new Nintendo, which is the Super Nintendo, and there's Super Mario, Mario, uh, Mario, uh, Super Mario World, actually. And uh, obviously, me and my brother nagged on my parents to buy this system, and I think the sole reason was Mega Man X, because this was the first game I saw in motion on the Super Nintendo. And it was really cool. I was like, I, I still remember. I, I recall it vividly to this very day. Like the first image of seeing seeing the game being displayed on the TV, and I was looking up from from uh, outside the store. I was like, hey, this is cool. Wow, look at Mega Man, man. He's he's, he's, uh, he's cool. So yeah, great game, great game. Still one of the best. Uh, everybody knows, obviously. Eagle wrapped this video by now, which and he compares the sequelitis, he compares classic Mega Man to Mega Man X, and everything he says it's true. I love this intro song, by the way. It's like the, the coolest Mega Man X intro song out of the trilogy on the Super Nintendo. I'm gonna keep playing, uh, keep it. <laughs> I don't wanna interrupt it. Okay, enough of my singing, enough of my terrible voice. Let's do it. Come on. Okay, doesn't want to start for some reason. Come on. There we go. Let's do it. This is the intro stage, the infamous intro stage. Still looks great, still looks great to this very day, man. And no matter what Eagle Raptor or anybody else says, these, these Mega Man X fanboys, the the remake for the PSP was absolutely awesome, man. The Marvel Counter X, man. I, I love this game and all, but the remake blew it out of the water. Yeah, it did change up a couple of things, but the changes were good. And the the, the remade storyline, the intro, the Day of the Sigma ending, that was all absolutely awesome. It was really cool to watch all that. Actually, I could live stream the intro. I, 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 I mean, live stream Marvel Hunter X. I didn't realize that the PSP has a component cable. I'll try that sometime. That should be cool. Yeah, music is one of the most memorable things of the game. I like it when it slows down after killing this thing. This dude, see, it slows down when you're going down. There we go. Still got it. Still got it. Even though I haven't played this game in decades. Okay, 
Man, the picture looks great on my TV. Looks excellent, actually. The HDMI feed is really giving some, <laughs> really giving the, the the this retro game quite a you know face off. A lot of people say no, the HDMI actually makes retro games a bit worse or a bit laggy. I'm not really sure if that's true or not. But in my case, Mega Man X looks amazing, man. I'm not sure if the slowdown is uh, reduced because this is a download, after all. Not really sure. But I do recall uh, seeing that, the, remember the, the Mega Man X collection for the GameCube? I think that eliminated all slowdowns from the game. Body on pause! Yeah, that's <laughs> the whole Eagle Raptors thing. There we go. Hopefully it looks as, as, as great on the feed, because it looks excellent on my TV, guys. I got HDMI cranked up to 1080. Uh, what do you call it? The upscaling on the Wii U. Come on, Vile, I know you're up there. I'm gonna fight like a man, or like a robot, or whatever. I know I'm gonna lose this fight. I wish I could beat this guy. Oops. I pressed the restore point by mistake. There we go. You worthless piece of scrap metal. You think you could defeat me? Ha ha ha. There's our friend Zero. I thought he was a girl at the beginning. When I was playing this game back then, I thought he was a girl. Because of the, the, the armor design and the hair. This is... Uh, Zero's theme is one of the coolest themes as well. Uh, they sort of screwed it up in Marvel Hunter X. It's just a piano. It was somber, but I didn't feel the same feeling as uh, the Super Nintendo original. I should become stronger. I can do it, I can do it. Yeah, this intro stage was sort of a sort of sort of a mind lore back then because you usually start Mega Man games with the boss select. Which is this thing. Yeah, Joe Penguin, that's the first guy you usually pick, I guess. There we go. I love the clean feed. I can't, I can't stress this enough. It looks, you know, the clean feed on the HD, uh, HD TV uh, with the HDMI output really makes uh, retro games, especially the Super Nintendo one, look look amazing. Uh, I could understand maybe the NES games, you know, all these 8-bit it -bit games look a bit worse because uh, there are some artificial uh, glitches and whatnot and it does, does really lag the controls a bit. I don't see lag in terms of Super Nintendo, but maybe the NES is a bit different. Hey, one up. I remember in Armored Armadillo stage, the bats were actually the classic bats from the Mega Man 2, you know, the ones in Woodman stage. I wish they kept them all with the, with the, the rest of the stages. Ow. Ow. The cool thing about Marvel Counter X is that they relocated all the... The, the X parts, these upgrades from Dr. Light. So it's possible in Marvel Counter X to actually beat the game without getting the foot part, but here you're forced to get it. Because it is an essential part of the game after all, you, you have to dash and jump. There we go, Dr. Light. Yep, give me my boost speed, please.
Nice. Now we can go a bit faster. There we go. Yeah. This is cool, man. Ow. So, how's the feed so far, guys? Hopefully, it's not laggy. Like I said, inform me in the comments. I'm reading them right now, and, and Jared's on standby with me as well. Yeah, see, the secret is up there. I need to get up there. But that's later. Eat this. Die. I need to link up... Uh, every time I mention a remi remix, I need to link it up in the YouTube description. There's a remix of this song by one fan. I forgot his name. I'm trying to remember his name. But basically, it's on the Dwelling of Duels competition. It's called Black Ice. If you guys could search for it on Google. Mega Man X Black... Black Ice? I think, yeah. Black Ice on Dwelling of Duels. Really cool rock remix of this, of this theme. You don't usually see uh, Chill Penguin Steam Remix. They like the other ones more. There we go. Come here, Mr. Chill Penguin. Ow. I forgot that he does that. Nope, you're not gonna ice me. Come on, come on. When is he gonna jump up there? There we go. Wow, that was close. Ow. Oops, missed him. That was close. So you guys have a bit of invincibility when he's sliding. Have to be careful. Okay, you're dead, man. Chill out. That was cheesy. That was cheesy, but funny. I'm a cheesy guy. Got him. Yeah, yeah, I know. Well, I don't need passwords now. Uh, some people are calling me. I don't want to answer. Because I want to play. Mm, where we, where we have to go after Chill Ping when I forgot? Who was weak against Ice? Was it this guy? Or was it... I think it's Flame Mammoth. I think so. Well, Ice Fire. Yeah, I think so. Let's go here. Oh, so yeah, so I had to go to Chill Penguin because see, if you go to Flame Mammoth first, the the this this is supposed to be lava down here. So now I can go get the secret stuff basically, and make the stage easier. So that's the real of the really cool aspects of my Mega Man S that I love. You could backtrack the stages and see changes when you uh, defeat certain bosses. Oh, there's something up there. I remember. I remember there's something up there. I think, but I think I need to uh, to have the one of the armor parts to get there. Maybe, not sure. Yeah, I think so. Well, we'll skip that for now. There we go. I remember the heart piece somewhere here. Nice. 
Ow. I hate these dudes. Down, 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 down. I need some health, man. Can't go against Flame Mammoth with this type of health. Come on. Ooh, lava. Oh man, I hate this guy too. It's annoying. Any guy with a shield in Mega Man games is annoying. That's my rule of thumb. Ow. I'm gonna die, right? Hmm. I think I'm gonna kill myself. Oh, let's try beating him head on, I'm not sure. Oops, did that, did that again. Yeah, one, two. There we go. I think, uh, no, no, not Flame Mouth, but uh, even uh, Storm Eagle. They're. Ow! Ow? Well, doesn't seem to be his weakness. Yeah, I sort of forgot who the weaknesses are here. I think it's better if I use the Buster. I'm gonna die, right? Yep. It's not his weakness. Epic fail. Who was the weakness of Flame Man? Was it Kuanger? Boomer Kuanger? I can't remember, man. Okay, let's try again. This time the Buster. Damn, this guy's strong. I can beat him. Come on. They jump farther this time. Come on. I know you're gonna flame them. Come on, Mammoth. I'm not stupid. Almost dead. Die. Yeah. Did it. So yeah, Jared says it's a bit choppy. I don't know how to optimize this actually, so I don't know what to do. There we go. Mm, so who do we go to? Now we have Flame Mammoth and Chill Penguin. Can't remember, I really can't remember, man. La 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 la. Was it this guy? Armadillo? Him? Mmm, maybe. Long Octopus was his name, I think. Yeah. I think maybe this is one of the guys that got redo redesigned for Marvel Hunter X. Him and Boomer Kowanger. I think they renamed him Boomerang Kowanger, I think. Pretty sure. Ow. Man, I love this background. Beautiful, beautiful. Ow. Ow. Damn you! Come on! Oh wow! This is, I didn't know I could do that! That's cheap! There's a lot of things flying at me in this level.
I think there's something up there. I'm not really sure. Uh oh. Uh, there's a bit of slowdown here. Too much, too much stuff going on. Too many things flying on the screen. Die. Give me something. Thank you. Arigato gozaimasu. No! <laughs> Sorry. Stay away! Ow. Okay, this is tricky. No, no, I don't wanna die! I'm gonna die. This is tricky, man. I hope I don't die. No, no! Oh, that was close, man. Look at that. Okay, this, yeah. Come on, whirlwind. There's something here. Any secrets here? Anything? Nothing? Nope. Maybe up there? Let's see if we can find some secrets here. Nope, no secrets here. How about if I go up and then jump? Nope. Bit of slowdown as well. Oh, there's something up there. I'm gonna kill this boat. Kill this boat. Die, boat! Submarine or whatever. Slow mo fall. Oh, nice. Am I supposed to do that? Is there a secret passageway or something? What's well, here? Can't remember. Oh my god, what the hell? Well, is it space or, or is it tail? Yeah, I think both. As long as I don't die. Man, this game is cool, man. Cool retro, that's what I call it. Nope. Come down here. Come on. I want some snake for lunch. Or eel or whatever. It's the thing take, come on. Die! Die! Die, 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 die! Wow. I'm contemplating on cheating and, <laughs> and using that, uh... Safe state mode. Well, it's not cheating per se. No need to use the password anymore. There we go. So let's try it. There we go. I will speedrun this game using the store points. How are the comments doing? Anybody here? Nope. Nobody except two people. Even Grindshock left us, too bad. Let's go up, go up, go up. I have a feeling I'm missing something in this stage, I'm not really sure what. Another dragon? Or whatever. Yep, it's coming up. Can I kill him fast? Nope, fire doesn't work here. So, so fire is not gonna be the weakness of this launch octopus dude. Fire was the weakness of uh, Chill Penguin. Where are you going, coward?
Come here. Come here. Man, the slowdown is part of the charm of this game. That's what I think. Come on, die. There we go, got him. No heartbeat this time around. I really hope Ice is the weakness of this guy. Nothing. Anything up there? Nope. Oh great! We got two people still here. Grind, Shock and Jared. Nice. I don't feel special with two viewers. Okay, launch off this. What? I'm going down? No, it's not his weakness. I'm gonna die. Oh, come on. I forgot all the weaknesses of this game. Nope, that's not gonna do anything. Well, gotta defeat him with the next buster. And I'm gonna die, I think. Yep. Epic fail, number two. I'm gonna try defeating him with the next buster. Let's see how good am I in this game. He's going down, I love his signaling, like, you're gonna go down, man! Very, uh, hip-hop-ish. Or, like he's from the hood or something. You're going down. Man, this guy's fast. Wow. That was like a fleet chance that. Nope. I could do it, I could do it. Come on, I can do it. I've defeated two with the next buster, so I can do this guy. No, no, no. No! I'm screwing up! Shit, shit, shit. Come on! Got him! Wow, that was close. But I feel like I'm missing something in this stage. I don't know, there's some sort of secret somewhere. I can't remember it, for the life of me. Yep, got the third thing. So Launch Octopus... I think Locks, uh, Launch Octopus... Uh, he's against, I think, Boomer Kerwanger. I remember like the Rockets was against the Boomerang or something like that. Hopefully I get it right this time around, I'm not really sure. Let's go here. Boomer Kuranger. Or Boomerang Kuranger in, in Marvel Counter X. This is one of the coolest songs in the game. It's very like catchy, techno y. I love it. Even the level design is pretty good in this. Uh, this level in particular, because it's in, uh, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's one of those levels. What do you call them? The one that, the ones that scroll up. It works here. It works here. Because there's a lot of dashing, a lot of jumping, so it works here well. Unlike Elect Man levels in uh, the original Mega Man, and that was uh, dreadful. Let's skip this dude.
Ow. Okay, great. I still I still have these. Shooting through walls. Nice, we did that. Uh oh. Gotta think fast here. These enemies are distracting while they're going up, man. Oh, God. My reflexes are even worse. Ow. Dead, uh. <laughs> Fail. Come on, he respawned. Uh, typical Mega Man, man. So this guy, this guy's use in life just comes out of this wall and then shoots something in front of him and go back, goes back again. What a very useless robot. Gotta slow down. Made it. Nothing here. What? How do I get that thing? Tricky jump? Nah, I think it's one of the weapons that I need. Yeah, can't get it for now. Too bad. Come on. I need some health. Badly. I need one of those energy tanks. I didn't get one yet. Not too many things going on. I hope I don't die here. I really don't feel like dying. Ah, oh, come on! Ah! Oh, well, at least I start off from here. That's good. Good enough. Oh no! Come on! I gotta go up again. Ah! Should have done that safe state. Well, let's play a bit of old school here. What's five minutes of awesome gameplay, right? Ow. I will find your house and say hello to you. I will say hello to you when I find your house next to me. Then I know that you're my neighbor today and tomorrow. La la la. Find my house next to your shack, yeah. Come on. Come on. There we go. Finally made it. Let's cheat a bit here. Ha ha ha. I need to charge my Wii U uh, gamepad.
excuse me for a second, guys. It's running out of juice. Oh, by the way, I did get that. Uh, I didn't, uh, didn't, I wasn't able to try yet, but I did get the, what do you call it? Uh, Nyko released a product for the Wii U. It's called the U Boost. What it basically is, it, uh, it, it attaches the additional battery at the back of your Wii U. Very easy to put put in there. You don't need to uh, remove anything or unscrew anything. Should add a, a couple of hours of uh, life. So I, uh, it's what is it for? Twenty dollars or twenty bucks or something like that. I advise everybody to get it. Should help a lot. Anyway, back to our regularly scheduled programming. Let's kill this guy. Boomer Kuwanger. What's a Kuwanger? That's what I like to know. Oh, great. It's his weakness. I don't need to face him. This guy's easy. Oh. Now I die. Okay, starting to teleport everywhere now. Like it. Got him. Very easy, like I said. There we go, got the boomer or whatever. Not sure it's a weakness for who. So, let's go, let's go... I don't know. Here? This guy? Yeah, I remember now. He's Cho Penguin's weakness. Because I remember there's, he has this cool animation uh, when in which you hit him with the Cho Penguin's weapon, he freezes all of a sudden. So I'm gonna go to this guy. Uh, let's do it. Spark Mandrill. That's the announcer for the Marvel Country Mix. This is another one of my favorites. A lot of people love remixing this song. Spark Mandrill's song is very rock oriented. Man, these sparks down there are very... Oh, look! Hmm. I remember the boomerang. I think you could get it with the boomerang. In some way. Come on! I want it! I got it! <laughs> Great! I needed that, man. Okay, dead end. The drums are really cool in this track as well. The sampled drums are really nice. in the dock. Ow! Damn you! Damn you too! Oh no! Okay. Ow! I'm gonna, I'm gonna die. Unless he dies first. Well, he didn't die first, so I'm gonna die. No, 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 please! Ah. No, game over! <laughs> oh no. That sucks. Let's try a different stage. Uh, what's with this guy's weakness? Is it Storm Eagle? I'm not really sure. I think so. I have to go back here again. 
I have to go back here again. At least I got the charge tank. There we go. Yeah, still checking the comments in our live stream here. Realizing that we didn't broadcast it to anybody, so we have uh, two people watching, basically. I don't know, yeah, we're, YouTube works really weird with the live streams, we're still not really... We didn't really put a hand on it, should we say. You gotta do a lot of things before you actually live stream, it's not that simple. Twitch is much easier, you know, it's just broadcast everything all of a sudden and, and you could actually uh, put your links on Facebook and Twitter. Automatic automatically. I know YouTube does that, but in the same time we don't want to fill everybody's Facebook and Twitter with every video we put because we, we do put two a day, so... Maybe we should, I'm not really sure. Maybe we should. Do I have the tank? Yeah, I do have it. I thought I didn't have it for a moment there. Now I'm gonna kill this guy. Come on, come here! Miss me, miss me. Die! He doesn't want to die! Finally! What a tough mid-boss. Thank you. Die. Ow. There we go, almost there. Wow, this guy <laughs> went out of the, the platform there. Need some help. Ah, there's something up there. Shall we get it? Come on, I can do it. Well, very hard to get actually. How do I get that? See, I, when the boomerang goes there, it, it stops, stops going, coming back to me. There we go. It's a very tricky jump. Got it. Oh, come on, I can do it. Ah. Ah! Got it! That's a tricky jump. Hi. Ow. Wow, this guy actually shoots it back, way back here. I'm gonna cheat. I'm gonna cheat. Yes, the restore point. I'm gonna cheat. Because I'm a cheater. And my reflexes are no longer retro. Nope. I won't die that way. <laughs> I cheated for the first time in Bigman X. So sue me. I hope these guys didn't do anything. Ah, no, no, no! I'm gonna cheat again. I don't wanna die, I really don't wanna die here. <laughs> nah, this is cheap. This is very cheap. I admit. <laughs> I don't feel like loading with store points here. I'll try this again. I need help anyway. It's 
too tedious to be cheap, you know? Especially if you have, if you have little health. You sort of stuck yourself in a, in a position that you don't want to be. Because one hit you're gonna die, so it's sort of useless to keep doing the restore point uh, thing. I guess this is gonna be the last level, guys, and then I'm gonna end up my stream. Again, this was just a test to just see how good this uh, stream is, and apparently the quality is not bad from what Jared and uh, what's his name, Grindshock is saying. It does get a bit choppy, but that's not my under my control. YouTube doesn't have any servers like Twitch, so they do everything automatically. Yeah, these things are really fast. Die. There we go. Finally. Come here. Come on, guy. You're gonna die. Ha ha ha. Ha ha ha! 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 Kick his ass! Maybe that was the easiest boss ever. Once you know the new weakness that is. There we go! So that ends off our test stream here of Mega Man X. Hope you two viewers enjoyed, and uh, either way, this is gonna be archived for everybody to watch on YouTube later. Which is cool. As a stupid password. So yeah, I hope you've enjoyed. Uh, this was a nice experiment, and uh, if you want any, you know, sort of uh, specific streams or let's plays of specific games, uh, we'll try to, you know, we'll try to do our best to uh, get these games for you. But uh, as soon as June, what is it, the release date of The Last of Us 13th or 14th hits, uh, Jared's gonna, definitely going to do a Let's Play or a stream of uh, the game. I'm going to try to do my own as well, so you got to get double the dose of content. And keep it locked to this channel and our website and our upcoming Twitch TV channel. So we're going to we're gonna do some live broadcasting and videos for E3, basically, which is going to happen in two days or so. So hope you've enjoyed once again more. And, uh, Give us any feedback. And uh, yeah, I guess next time we're gonna, as uh, what Grindlock and everybody else is suggesting, I think we're gonna, you know, stream, I guess, from Twitch because it's easier. We'll see what happens though. This was an experiment. So yeah, signing off. See you guys later. Bye.